Hi, I'm Russ Toronto, and we're here to talk a little bit about the height prediction program we offer through Oval Sports Medicine as part of Sports Medicine Utah. What height prediction program does, it, it gives uh, an accurate assessment of where an individual uh, child, either male or female, uh, may end up being in terms of their ultimate adult height by virtue of taking an x-ray and measuring their height at the present time. Some kids will be on the lower end of the growth curve and be maybe immature as far as their skeleton goes and end up being very tall and other kids may be permanently uh, at their permanent adult height at the time of their 15 or 16 years old. So what this does, it gives uh, uh, parents and an individual athlete the chance to see where their growth is going to take them and where they might be at the current time. So as part of the process, you'll come into our office and we'll take you back into the x-ray area, which is back here. And Ashley or we'll take an x-ray of the individual's hand. There's minimal x-ray exposure, so there's no concern there. So just a picture of the hand. And then we have a way here to measure the height. So we'll measure the individual's height that they currently are. So an x-ray in the height. And then we'll take the x-ray we get uh, over to, to compare it to uh, some pictures we have that are part of a scientific study that was done that tells us where an individual is in their height and growth pattern. So we'll get an x-ray that looks somewhat like this and has growth plates which are these little dark lines here, here, and here in the fingers, the hand, and the wrist. And by looking at those growth plates, be able to take it and compare to several other different x-rays uh, and tell us whether an individual is nine years old in their growth curve or whether they're 13 or 16. And once we get that established, we can go to a chart which shows us uh, both their bone age, which goes across the top. That's what we just determined with their x-ray. And then their, mature, and their height, where they are at this point in time, go across and down and match it up with where they might be. So they may be 70 inches when they get to be fully mature or 75 and we can tell that by a combination of the x-ray where they currently are and what their height currently is. The other advantages and benefits to doing this are you can tell if an individual is prepared or ready to do uh, vigorous weight training programs which shouldn't be done as long as there's open growth plates and also where and, and an athlete might be most appropriately uh, placed in terms of the sport they like to play. Say an athlete likes to play a bunch of different sports, soccer, baseball, basketball, football, and it turns out they're going to be shorter, then maybe focus more on those sports. It turns out they're playing those sports, but they're going to be on the tall end of the scale, then maybe they focus a little bit more on basketball or football. I'm always a proponent of it, a, a individual athlete playing as many sports as they can for as long as they can, but at some point in time it will give you some idea where to focus the efforts on the training they might do and the extra work they might do and what, what uh, sport to focus on. So with height prediction, it gives us benefits in terms of knowing how tall an athlete might be, which is kind of fun, but also some benefits, added benefits in knowing how to uh, focus training and workout schedules for the athlete at the given age they are. Thanks.